today's video i am going to explain the problem from complex integration now in this video we have to evaluate integral z bar dz from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 4 plus 2i along the curves given by z is equal to t square plus i into t along the line z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 2i and there from z is equal to 2i to z is equal to 4 plus 2i see here let me explain you so what is given so we have to evaluate integral z bar into dz from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 4 plus 2i the given curve is see here from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 4 plus 2i and see z is given as this is t square plus i into t what is z z is equal to x plus i y is equal to this is t square plus i into t so here z starts from z is equal to 0 so if we keep z is equal to 0 so if z is equal to 0 so this is nothing but 0 plus i into 0 this is t square plus i into t so if we compare so we got the value of t as 0 and see here the next thing here is z is equal to 4 plus 2i so if we substitute z is equal to this is 4 plus 2i so z is nothing but x plus 2y so in place of that if we keep 4 plus 2i this is 4 plus 2i is equal to here this is t square plus i into t so t square is equal to 4 and therefore directly t is equal to 2 so we got the limits if we transform in terms of t that is if z is equal to 0 so we have to keep t is equal to 0 and if z is equal to 4 plus 2i then t will be t is equal to 2 so these are the limits and now we have to evaluate z bar see here z bar is nothing but what is z z is given as t square plus i into t and z bar is nothing but t square minus i into t if we evaluate so if we evaluate z bar into dz from z is equal to 0 from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 4 plus 2 i see then what is z bar so z bar is equal to t square plus i into t and now dz so if we transform this in terms of uh, dz this will be 2t into dt so what is z t square plus i into dt so dz will be see here dz will be for t square this is 2t and for i i this is 1 into this is dt so in place of dz i am writing 2t plus i into dt between the limits the t limits are from so actually we have to take from z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 4 plus 2i so if we transform in terms of t the limits are t is equal to 0 to t is equal to 2 so t is equal to 0 to 2 is equal to 2 now if we calculate this one so if i multiply so this will be 0 to 2 so this will be 2t cube plus this is uh, t square so this is t square into i and this will be minus i 2t square i square this is minus of minus plus 1 into t into dt now the real part and the imaginary part are here so this is t square i and this is 2t square i so this will be 0 to t this is 2t cube minus this will be t square i plus t into dt now if i make an integration with respect to t so with respect to t what happens here so this will be 2 times of this will be 2 times of t power 4 by 4 minus i times of this is uh, 3 cube by t and this is t square by 2 between the limits t limits are from t is equal to 0 to t is equal to 2 if i substitute the same thing here then this will be 2 by 4 into 2 power 4 this is a 16 minus i times of this is 2 cube this is 8 by 3 and 2 square this is 4 by 2 so if i cancel this for 4 times and this for 2 times this is 4 2 is 8 plus this is 8i by 3 plus 2 the value here is 8 plus 2 this is 10 plus this is 8i by 3 
so this is along the line z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 4 plus 2i the first value here therefore we got the value of integral z bar dz that is 10 plus 8i by 3 along so along z is equal to 0 to z is equal to this is 4 plus 2i so the value here the value here is 10 plus 8i by 3 is the value so this is the value according to the question so what is asked here so they asked to find out the z bar and z is given as t square plus i into t so we have to transform z bar and we have to write the conjugate of it that is t square minus i t and dz will be 2t and i is equal to 1 into dt so here the limits also for z is equal to 0 for z is equal to 0 t limit is 0 for z is equal to 4 plus 2 i so here this is of the form x plus i y so if we compare t square will be 4 and ultimately t is equal to 2 so these are the limits and if we substitute and calculate in terms of t so we got the answer as 10 plus 8 i by 3 and the next equation here is along the line z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 2i and there from z is equal to 2i to z is equal to 4 plus 2i and let's see. So this is the second question. So again we have to evaluate z bar into dz. So z is equal to 0 to z is equal to this is 4 plus 2i. So here the limits are from and first of all along z is equal to z. Let's see along and the second solution along z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 2i. So what is this? So this will be xy plane. So this is the xy plane. So z is equal to 0 is nothing but the origin in xy plane. And z is equal to 2i is nothing but the imaginary line. So this is i and this value is 2i. So along the line that is z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 2i so the value here will be in terms of y that is 0 comma 2 so this is 0 and this is uh, some name it as b and the next thing is from there z is equal to 2i so this is z is equal to 2i and this is 4 in x axis so this is 1 2 3 and this is 4 to 2i so this value is 2i so this is i and this is 2i so along 0 to a and this is b so the b point here is so the x value here is 4 and y value here is 2 this is 4 comma 2 so the value here is 4 comma 2 this is 2i z is equal to 2i to z is equal to 4 plus 2i this is real value and this is imaginary value now we have to calculate along oa and next along ab and we have to add up these two see first of all along O A. So what is O? Origin is nothing but 0 comma 0 and A point is nothing but 0 comma 2. If you observe 0 is a constant value and Y varies from 0 to 2. See here Y it's varying from the point 0 to 2 and X is a constant value. Therefore DX value is equal to 0. And now if I substitute the same thing here in this equation Z bar. So if I substitute the same thing z bar into dz so as you know that z is equal to x plus i y and automatically dz bar it is the conjugate that is x minus i y so here the dz value z, z bar is nothing but this is x sorry this is x minus i y so this is x minus i y so cancel this one and dz is nothing but dx plus i into this is dy so between the limits here we have to substitute x is equal to 0 and dx is equal to 0 and y varies from 0 to 2. See here x value so x is equal to 0 here and dx value is equal to 0. So if I substitute from this condition along OA then y varies from 0 to 2. This will be i y into and this will be i into dy i square as you know that i square is equal to minus 1 so y is equal to 0 to 2 this is minus 1 into minus 1 plus 
this is y into dy which is equal to y square by 2 between the limits 0 to 2. So 2 square this is 4 by 2 the value here is 2. Therefore integral OA along OA the z bar dz value is equal to 2. This is equation number A. And now see here and from there and from there z is equal to 2i. So here z is equal to 2i to z is equal to 4 plus 2i. Now we have to calculate along AB. So along AB, what is point A? So A is nothing but 0, 2. This is real axis and this is imaginary axis. And see this is the real part 4 and this is the imaginary part y axis. So in this case, what is a constant value? So y is constant. So y is constant value as 2. So y is equal to 2. Therefore dy is equal to the derivative is 0. And x varies from the point 0 to 4. So x varies from the point 0 to 4. Now we have to evaluate integral z bar into dz. So what is z bar? So z is nothing but this is sorry x minus i y. And dz is nothing but this is dx plus i into dy. So now in place of y I have to substitute 2. x minus this is 2i into dx. So dy is equal to 0. So this value is substituted as 0 and y is equal to 2. And see now the x limits are from 0 to 4. See x varies from 0 to x is equal to 4. Now, if I make a derivative with respect to x, this will be x square by 2, 2y into x between the limits. See here, x varies from x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 4. If I substitute, this will be 4 square that is 16 by 2 and if I substitute 4 here, this will be 8i. So, if I cancel this for 8 times, the value here is 8 minus 8i. So, this is nothing but this is along AB. So, this is along AB Z bar into DZ. Now, we need the integral that is along Z bar DZ along the first one is OB. See here, along this is uh, OA, along OA and along AB. So, along OA along OA this is Z bar DZ and next along AB this is Z bar DZ. So therefore our total integral integral Z bar DZ is equal to so from the first value what is Z bar? So from this the what is Z bar along OA the value here is 2. If I substitute the same thing as 2 and next along AB so this is value B and uh, this value is nothing but 8 plus 8 minus 8i. So therefore integral z bar dz is equal to this is 10 minus 8i and this is how we have to solve and this is so simple if you follow these steps here. See first of all along z is equal to 0. z is equal to 0 in xy plane it is nothing but x0 y0 and this is 2i. 2i is nothing but the imaginary point 2. Imaginary point is nothing but y. So 0 comma 2. So along OA the value here is 2 and next from then we have to uh, evaluate along the line z is equal to 2i. So z is equal to 2i is nothing but the y value as 2 and x is equal to 0 and z z x value as 4 and y value as 2 so x4 and y2 and along ab so along ab also we evaluated and we got the value as 8 minus 8i so the final integral that is integral z bar dz is equal to a plus b so a value is 2 and b value is 8 minus 8i and the total value is 10 minus 8i and this is how we have to solve this is also so simple if you follow these steps we, you can solve any problem of this kind and please practice and pass it on to your friends thank you so much for staying till the end